はいどうも佐藤潤チャンネルでございます暑いですね夏ですね、えー、今回はパスファブの提供で動画を作成しております皆さん Windows パソコンを使っているとこんな問題に遭遇することってないですかね、えー、パソコンの電源を入れたのに起動しないうんともすんとも言わなくてニッチもサッチもいかなくてね、まあ、その場合になって慌てたりとかえー、まあ画面がブルースクリーンやブラックスクリーンになって固まったとか、えー、パソコンが起動できなければデータを取り出すことすらできませんよね特にこの暑い季節、えー、コンピューターの負担が大きくなって特にねこういったトラブルに遭遇しやすくなりますこれらの問題を解決するのがパスファブコンピューターマネージメントなんです具体的に、えー、どのように操作するのか、えー、操作自体は、あの、ポイントさえ分かれば、すごくね、簡単なことなんですけれども、とはいえですね、なんかこう、選択するところがたくさんあったりとか、なんかこう、クリックするボタンがたくさんあったりとかね。だからもう、あの、初心者の方にとっては、何をしていいか分かんないんですよね。えー、そのあたりを動画で、詳しく解説していきたいと思います。それでは、行ってみましょう Hello everyone. Welcome to the PassFab channel. How to fix computer with blue screen or unbootable problem. This video will show you how to use PassFab computer management. Part 1 Create a boot disk with computer management. Launch computer management. Click on Create boot disk now. Select the operating system that n e e d to be fixed. Then insert the USB flash drive into the computer. Click Next, then click Continue. Wait for the repair environment ISO download to complete and burn. After successfully creating the boot disk, click See Instruction and follow the action. Part 2 Use the boot disk to enter the P system. First, Insert the burned boot disk into the computer that needs to be repaired. Start the computer. When the computer logo appears on the screen, tap F12 to enter the boot menu. Choose the USB disk to boot the P system. Wait for the P system to complete loading. OK, computer management has been started. Part 3 Smart System Repair with Computer Management. In the System Repair screen, click on the Automated Repair option. Select the operating system from the partition and click Start Repair. Wait for the System Repair to complete. OK, click Restart when the repair is complete. The computer will start normally. Part 4 Recovery Password and Key with Computer Management. In the Computer Management screen, select Password Reset. Click Start. Select the Windows System and click Next. Choose the account for which you want to change or remove the password. Below, you can choose to change or delete the Windows password and also create a new administrator account. Click Next. The password will be changed to Rio 123456. Restart your computer through the Start menu. OK, log into your account with your new password. Go back to the Software Key Recovery screen. Click Start. Select the corresponding system disk letter in the Windows installation. The product key will be displayed below. Click Save and select the path to save. Rename the file name and click Save. Restart the computer. The key information is stored in a text file.
Part 5, Data Recovery with Computer Management. Select the Data Recovery option and click Recover Now. Select the disks from which you need to recover files or select all disks. Click Start. Select the file type you want to recover and click on the Scan File Type option. Wait for the file scan to complete, then click Understood. In the file list, select the file you want to recover. Click Recover and select the path where you want to save the recovered files. Select Recover and wait for the file recovery to complete. OK, select Restart Computer. After the computer starts, view the recovery files on the disk. Part 6. Use the disk tools in computer management. Among the disk tools, there are backup and recovery, partition management, and data wipe. Click Start. Select to wipe specific folders. Click on the Add option and select the folder to be wiped. Select the folder and click Next. You will see the message that the data cannot be recovered after erasing. Click on Yes. Wait for the erase to complete and select Restart Computer. In the folder, the erased data has disappeared. Well, this is about how to use PassFab Computer Management. Click the link in the description below to get PassFab Computer Management. If you have any questions during the process, please leave them in the comment section below. We will respond positively to your message and help you solve the problem. If you found this video helpful, please give us a thumbs up and subscribe to us. Thank you for watching. See you in the next video. やっぱりね、全くわかんなかったら難しいですよね。どうあの、安心してください。え、不安な人は無料の体験版もございますので、パスファブコンピューターマネジメントをご紹介しました。え、この動画がね、参考になったな、役に立ったなと思ったら、ぜひ、グッドボタン、それからチャンネル登録の方もよろしくお願いします。というわけで、ただちゅんチャンネルでした